find the LCM of 96 and 98. To find the LCM, for that we should frame it in this way. 96 comma 98. This is your step 1. Now you should focus on to the first number which is 96 here. In this number last digit 6 E1 so take 2. First number 9. A number close to 9 in 2 table is 2 4 8. 9 minus 8 1 1 carried forward 16. When do we get 16 in 2 table? 2 8 16. The other number 98 last digit 8 E1 so this is divisible by 2. First number 9. A number close to 9 in 2 table is 2 4 8. 9 minus 8, 1, 1 carried forward, 18. When do we get 18 in 2 table? 2 nines, 18. Now here we have 48, last digit 8, E1, so take 2. First number 4, when do we get 4 in 2 table? 2 twos, 4. The other number 8, when do we get 8 in 2 table? 2 fours, 8. Now the other number 49, last digit 9, not E1. So this is not divisible by 2. So you write it down as it is. Now here we have 24 last digit 4 E1 so take 2. First number 2 when do we get 2 in 2 table 2 1s 2. The other number 4 when do we get 4 in 2 table 2 2s 4. The other number 49 not divisible by 2 so you write it down as it is. Now here we have 12 12 is 2 6 12. The other number 49 not divisible by 2 so you write it down as it is. Now here we have 6, 6 is 2, 3, 6. The other number 49 not divisible by 2 so you write it down as it is. Now here we have 3, 3 is a prime number so 3, 1 is 3. The other number 49 not divisible by 3 so you write it down as it is. Now we got 1 here so focus on to the next number 49. Always remember 7 into 7, 49. That is 7 times 7 is 49. Now we have 7, 7 is a prime number, so 7, 1, 7. So we got 1 in both the places. So our LCM is, LCM is the product of these numbers. That is, how many times did we get 2? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So 2 into 2 into 2 into 2 into 2 into 3 into 7 into 7. When we multiply these numbers, we get 4704 is our LCM.